Welcome to Senior Night for the University of Idaho's women basketball team. Today they'll be playing Southern Utah University here in the Cowan Spectrum. This is the second meeting between the teams. Last time they met at Southern University and Idaho won 85-68. Idaho beat the school record of 18 three-pointers, which helped ignite the win. In the second half, the Vandals trailed by 13 points, but then came back late in the third quarter. The Vandals are looking to keep their score and not trail behind. The crowd is feeling tonight, and it is senior night for University of Idaho. Our senior tonight is Agata Trujillo, who's been injured all season and is finally back in the game, and also Carly Wilson, one of our top scorers for the season. It is spirit night as well, so the crowd is very full and enthusiastic. We'll catch you back after this. For the starting lineup, we have number two, Rebecca Cardenas for the Thunderbirds. Guard, number 14, Bree Reed. We have guard number three, Bree Reed. We have forward number 40, Dari Ranson. And forward number 43, Jessica Richardson. Forward number 43, Dari Ranson. 55, Jamie and Smith. guard number 55, Southern Jerry Utah Smith. They are coached by Chris Betcher, and their conference standings right now are 2 and 15. Now it's time for the Vandals lineup. And we are excited in the Cowan Spectrum! Guard number two, Carly Wilson, is going to be starting the game. Post number four, Brooke Riley will also be playing in the game. Bridget O'Neill will also be playing. Guard number 21, Michaela Ferenz, will also be playing. And senior Agata Trujillo will finish up the starting lineup. Reed tries to shoot. It's no good. There's also a foul on the play from the Vandals. Number four, Brooke Riley. This is the team's second. Bree Reed at the line shooting for two. It seems that the crowd gets really rowdy, hoping they would not make their shot. She makes her first foul shot. On to her second one. Score 30-26, Vandals. Seems that Southern Utah is starting to catch the Vandals. Taylor Pierce and Jerry McCorkle are now in for the Vandals. Number four shoots her foul shot, and it's no good. And Pierce tosses it to Riley. Riley passes it to Wilson. Wilson shoots for three, and it is no good. The ball is jumbled all across the court. It gets passed back to the Vandals. Wilson gets the ball, but it is taken by Cardenas. Cardenas goes up for two, and it's good. And Wilson gets the ball, and McCorkle tries to shoot. Seems to get fouled, but it's not called. Picked up by the Thunderbirds, number 55, Smith. Smith passes it over to number 24. Donald McDonald shoots for two, and it's no good. Pierce shoots for three right off the bat, and it's good. That was a deep shot, and it was nothing but net. Score 33-29 Vandals with 20 seconds left to go. Thunderbirds are taking it really slow down the court. Number two, Cardenas, just holding the ball. You would think that they would want to make a comeback in this chance, but she's just holding it. They're rushing inside. 24, McDonald gets the ball, shoots up for two, and it is no good. Ball's jumbled around, and it's out of bounds. Two seconds left. Score 33-29. Thunderbirds have the ball. It gets tossed in to number 55, Smith. Smith shoots, and it's no good. That will end the first half. Southern Utah 29, Vandals 33. It seems that the Vandals' field goal percentage has gone up 40%, and Southern Utah has surpassed them at 44%. This is leaving it a really close game. Score is 33-29, Vandals. The leading scorers right now are McCorkle with 12 points for the Vandals, and Richardson, 12 points for the Thunderbird. This will be a game that will keep you on your toes and keep things very interesting. For a spear game, I couldn't have chose a better, more competitive team. This is Hunter Funk. You can catch us on the road to Reno inside the Vandals.